Bradley Walsh hosted a special celebrity edition of Beat the Chasers on Tuesday night. The first famous face to take on the team of Chasers was former Countdown star Carol Vorderman. She battled it out on the ITV quiz show in a bid to win a cash prize for charity. However, some viewers were left distracted by Carol's appearance. Carol donned a figure-hugging red dress on Tuesday's episode of Beat the Chasers. The star paired the long-sleeved lace frock with a pair of nude high heels. She was hoping to show off her quizzing skills and win some money for charity on the show. However, many viewers were left distracted by Carol's appearance, taking to Twitter to comment on her good looks. Coronation Street exit as Tim Metcalf dies? Hashtag beat the chasers Carol Vorderman is absolutely stunning for her age, looks incredible, at Cricket Kenneth said. Carol Vorderman looking amazing especially for 61 years old Hashtag beat the chasers, at Toon Pete 85 remarked. At Sadler Fiona 21 wrote, Carol looks beautiful Hashtag beat the chasers. Hashtag beat the chasers at Carol Vorders has the most amazing figure. I'm so jealous. At Anne Marie underscore sings added. Carol's looking great hashtag beat the chasers, at the Irish stew posted. However, it seems not everyone was impressed with Carol's bold red outfit choice. Unpopular opinion. Carol Vorderman looks ridiculous hashtag beat the chasers, at Mr underscore MC underscore 73 said. Unfortunately, Carol struggled when she went head to head with the chasers. She passed on multiple questions in a row and eventually ran out of time on the clock. The competition was close as the chasers beat the former countdown star with only two seconds to spare. Dot the repair shop's Steve Fletcher details emotional moment on set, must see the chases Sean Wallace snaps at Bradley Walsh after failed joke, watch EastEnders horror as Aaron attack leaves Bobby hospitalized? Spoilers, I can't believe that. I cannot believe that, Carol exclaimed after losing. Wow, Bradley said, shocked by the nail-biting finish to the game. I can't believe it, Carol reiterated with her head in her hands. Bradley commented, that was tough to take. But, one more and we were dead, Mark Labitt chimed in, highlighting how close she was to winning. One more. Yeah, one more and they were finished, Bradley agreed. Oh man. Carol exclaimed, making it clear she was gutted by the result. However, Carol didn't go home empty-handed and was gifted £1,000 for her chosen charity. Beat the Chasers airs weekdays at 9pm on ITV.